Hi everybody, this is a quick MadMapper 5.1 tutorial and I'm going to show you how to use the new MadCurve widget within your materials. First thing to do is to invoke the code editor over here and create a new material uh, that I'm going to call Curve Test, for instance, and I'm going to use the All Widgets template. Okay, now the material is created, let me put it uh, in my scene, this is there. So to see what's going on, let me first uh, remove the background, like this. Okay, so you can see here I have my curve uh, widget. I can modify like this, boom. At some points by double clicking, boom. Like this and make some kind of a little uh, bouncing animation, like that. Okay. So this widget is actually controlling the animation of my white line. If I go there in the um, ESF package on top of my material, you can see that uh, the widget is there. It's a mat, mat curve, type curve, and here I can change the interpolation methods. So there is the no interpolation method. You can see there it's all flat. I can switch it to linear. I build now it's uh, straight lines I can use the Hermite uh, curve style I build it now it's smoother or the catmull uh, rom catmull underscore rom strange name but cool feature and to use it uh, a mad mapper is actually creating a 1D texture so I'm getting the data from this from this texture over here using the EMG norm pixel function provided by mad mapper I'm referencing the mat curve this is the name of my uniform and here I'm sampling according to time and with this I can actually animate uh, my 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 elements into the materials so this is a very cool feature i hope you like it thanks for watching